Good evening. I'm David Schatzko, our Ray Music Statistic Director. Before we start, I wanted to share a story. Uh, my two elder children have been in virtual school all year, from September through June. And each day before class, the teachers would recite their land acknowledgement. Same words every day. Sometimes it would be a little longer, sometimes a little shorter, but on the whole, it was the same thing every day. Then in June, um, my elder son's second grade class, um, the teachers started to ask the students to volunteer to do the land acknowledgement themselves. And I think, the, I think the teachers expected to be coaching the students a bit more on this. Um, but what actually happened was that by that time in the year, the kids had the land acknowledgement memorized. And every day, uh, a different student would get up and with a little bit of prompting and a little bit of help on the bigger words, uh, would recite their land acknowledgement, just like they've been hearing every day before class. The Latin acknowledgement is something that I've been worried about with array music all year. Um, I have felt that without the connection with the audience, without being in the same room with the listeners, uh, without having our feet on the same land, and without being available before and after the concert to talk, um, I've been worried that our Latin acknowledgement is doing sort of less and less at a time when it should be doing more and more. But watching my son's class, uh, watching this eight-year-old students recite their land acknowledgement from memory, just from listening to the words every day, was a stark reminder of how important it is that we do say these words, and that we do say these names, and that we remember um, the events of the past. So, before we begin the concert, I want to acknowledge that Array Music operates on ancient land, land that has seen and supported humanity for 15,000 years. It is the land of the Batum First Nations, the Seneca, and more recently, the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nation. This land is the subject of the Dish With One Spoon Wampum Belt Covenant, an agreement between the Anishinaabek Nation and the Haudenosaunee Confederacy to peaceably share and care the resources in the Great Lakes region. Today, Toronto is still a meeting place, and the Dish With One Spoon Wampum Belt Covenant is still something that we must uphold and honor today. Thank you for joining us for this exceptional season, and I do look forward to seeing all of you in person in the near future. Thank you. We're live? Hi everybody, you'll have to forgive us, we're not ready to go, and so you're going to have to wait and listen to me blather on um, as I get my mic set. Rain, that's the problem, rain and taxis not running as rapidly as normal. So. What's happening here? Ah, there we go. Okay, if you're listening on your computer, listen in stereo because that's what this is all this trouble is about Ooh. so my apologies for this uh well actually the weather's apologies for this because it's the weather that did it and uh, we're still waiting for john oswald um In case you didn't see, if you're tuning in for a reason other than being on my list, uh, you won't know that, um, well, you'll know now by looking at it, there's no piano here. That's because there's no Michael Snow here, again. But um, Michael is resting, and we're, we eagerly look forward to his return. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm perched on 
this thing. So, welcome. This is uh, CCMC's October um, episode in our 21-22 array residency or residence. Um, and um, it's going to be the trio of Oswald Canavar and Dutton. That's me. That's Canavar. And Oswald will be over there once he gets here. And um, okay. Sorry for the fussing.
for that one uh, okay uh, it was for those of you oh hello Mani and Jill and uh, Manasi and oh damn I forget the newcomers name yeah, well anyway and to him too uh, oh look at that seems to be a half an hour has gone by well, uh, we'll uh, take a break now and uh, see if we can flush out John Oswald from wherever he's hiding. And um, we'll be back in about 10 minutes. It's, uh, we are regularly now doing half-hour sets, two half-hour sets for each of our uh, live stream appearances here at Array. And uh, so... Um, uh, take a break, go get a beer or a glass of milk or a cookie and a glass of milk or a joint or whatever it is and um, we'll see if we can find out what's happening with Mr. Oswald.
thanks for coming and uh, do return we'll be back to do another set either two or three of us
And here we are again, and uh, greetings to Arka, whose name we fouled up earlier. Um, we know that the Manassis and the Alton, that the Astons are always watching. So, um, well, seems that John Oswald got his wires crossed somehow. We haven't established exactly what, but it's too late to have him join us now, because we're, unless he's, uh, you know, hanging at the door and on his way up the stairs or something, but we'll play for another half an hour and, uh, and then go home. Just to remind anybody who uh, is coming in late or anybody who wouldn't know anyway, John Camavar, Paul Dutton, to, well, half CCMC. So what's that make us? Is it CC or CM or MC? It's whatever it's going to be. And this is what it is.
Is that, I don't know if that was half an hour. Does it really matter? It was about half an hour, 25 yeah. minutes. Yeah. Um, I guess you want to go home. You want to do a short one? Yeah, why don't we do a short one? That's yeah. exactly what I was thinking, actually. Just one more. Just a, a, just a short one. About, so just a little about that high. Yeah, that high. Yeah. I'd call that short, wouldn't you? Yeah, that's good. Yeah. So we're going to do a short one. Um, then I'm going to go home and have a short one. Is that expression still fly? Um, no. It's no? Just a short one, like two fingers? Well, that just means a small drink. Small drink, yeah. So, I don't know. It's been around, uh, it's been around since the 40s and the 50s, just like me. And um, so, uh, yes, uh, thanks for watching and listening, whoever has been watching and listening, other than aforementioned uh, Lonnie, Joe, Manasi, and Arka. Uh, Manasi and Arka must have gone to bed by now, uh, let's hope. But anyway, um, anybody else out there? Uh, uh, Jill, take Dad's care. Alive. Oh, she would. Yes, hello back, Jill, for the third or fourth time. <laughs> anyway, uh, thank you all and any who were participating silently off in their own private little places. And um, we are, as said previously, going to do one more short one and then hit the road.
CMC for October and we will be back in November on the last Friday of November you can keep your eye on the Array Music uh, Digital Concert Hall, is that right? Dan? You're going to be on the Digital Concert Hall or where on? Where? It'll be on the uh, Array website which should be uh, <laughs> let me pick it up I think it is ArrayMusic.com I think you'll find it's .ca is it? Yeah, I think so. I think it's I think we've uh, we've bought the dot com, but it is the CA. So arraymusic.ca. Oh, okay. Okay. So there you go. You want to find out details, and uh, those who are on my mailing list, my emailing list, will uh, receive the link once I find it out. And um, thanks again. Take well, thank care. Thank you, Dan. Thanks very much. Good night.